stories for you, firstly viewers, an expert who monitors uh, cargo flights between uh, Turkey and Ethiopia, Iran and Ethiopia, UAE and Ethiopia has released some details. He says that suddenly uh, flights from the UAE for Ethiopia have stopped. These flights were continuing for the last four months uh, and on weekly basis uh, several flights were arriving mostly on Harar Maida airport uh, which is Ethiopian Air Force Base. Suddenly the flights have stopped, we have details for you. Secondly, words, Debrecen Gabri Mikhail, Tigray's president, last night issued a statement. He was part of a Zoom meeting as well. I told you that he was uh, live there. Uh, so there were fears, there were rumors rather that he had been killed. But uh, all rumors were dispelled last night when he appeared live in the meeting. The statement has been issued by Debrecen, which is very important because he is telling us about the cause of withdrawal. Why is that Tigray Defense Force uh, withdrawing and what is future strategy of, of uh, Tigray Defense Force? Is this war coming to an end? Will TDF fight? Where will it fight? In Kambolcha, in Dasi, in Vuldia, in Makale? His statement gives us a little uh, picture of what TDF is planning to do. Firstly, it was an expert who monitors uh, flights uh, uh, between Ethiopia and other countries have released some details. Gajron, uh, he monitors flights uh, which are not recorded in civil aviation records uh, because uh, mostly these flights are carrying weapons. So, they are not recorded in civil aviation records, but these experts, they have some equipment on the ground. So, they, they manage to track these flights. He has shared some details about the flights between the UAE, Iran and Ethiopia. And suddenly, the flights from Ethiopia, flights from the UAE for Ethiopia have stopped. Have a look at this detail we used. Red colored uh, bars show the number of flights arriving each week in Ethiopia from the UAE. You can see that each week uh, flights are arriving, uh, sometimes 6, sometimes 10, sometimes uh, 2. The flights have been arriving within the past 4 months on a weekly basis. Uh, green colored bar shows flights from Iran viewers. Uh, we, we can see that at least 10 flights can be seen uh, which arrived in Ethiopia from Iran. Now, last uh, bar, you can see there is no bar uh, in the last 6 days. It means there was no flight between the UAE and Ethiopia within the last 6 days. These flights have been continuing within the last 4 months. Each bar indicates the flights which arrived in one week. So now when Ethiopian government forces are making gains, when they are uh, taking back territories, when Tigray Defense Forces are withdrawing, suddenly the flights from the UAE towards Ethiopia have stopped. Well, though uh, UAE and Ethiopia, they have not issued any official statement. But so much has been provided as evidence that we do know that uh, the UAE has been actively backing Ethiopian government. It has been militarily backing Ethiopian government and Turkey too, uh, to some extent. Uh, we have seen statements and claims uh, from TPLF leaders too. Geta Shoreda also talked about Turkey supplying high quality drones to uh, Ethiopian government. These are not, not just claims when a couple of leaders say something, obviously they have some evidence. They, they would not want to uh, ruin their relation with other countries. So, so, they have some evidence, that is why they are saying that. And evidence is right on the screen for you that uh, the UAE, which was actively backing Ethiopian government, uh, has now stopped its flight towards Ethiopia. Because obviously now Ethiopian government forces are on the charge, 
they are making gains and uh, Tigray defense force is withdrawing. Secondly, viewers, the Brazilian government, Tigray is president, yesterday issued a statement. He was part of a live Zoom meeting too. We confirmed that. We were waiting for his statement because General Vare they spoke yesterday. And I said, why is that Tigray is president is silent? He should lead from the front. He should be the one telling us what Tigray defense force is planning to do. Will TDF withdraw all together back into Tigray? Will it continue its fight? He must talk to his people. So yesterday he issued a statement. Three important things are mentioned in the statement. Firstly, he says that some time ago when Tigray forces were advancing towards Debre Tabor in Gondar, South Gondar, Suddenly, their supply lines were attacked near Kashina and they had to retreat from Debre Tabor towards Kashina. I think I reported that back then in several videos. He says similar things uh, could have happened here as well when TDF was moving towards Addis Ababa. So, TDF supply lines uh, could have been hit from afar and from Kashina sites because TDF was overstashed. So, that is why TDF has decided to do some, to, to make some decisions. Tigray Defense Force has decided to make some adjustments, some tactical maneuvers. He says these are tactical moves. War is not coming to an end. Second important thing which he says is that, he says, we want to fight on our convenient ground. What does he mean uh, on our conveni convenient ground? Does he mean Dasi? Does he mean Kambolcha, Vuldia, Raya, uh, Makele? Where would Tigray Defense Force like to fight? Which would be its convenient ground? But he is telling us that TDF will keep on fighting. It's on the TDF surrendering. TDF will now fight on its convenient ground. We don't know about this convenient ground, uh, uh, they are withdrawing so far, uh, so will they fight in Western Tigray, will they fight in Makele, will they fight in Vuldia? That we will have to wait to see, but he is confirming that uh, uh, TDF is not surrendering, that war will go on. And lastly, he is calling upon the people, he is saying that people should trust Tigray defense force, Tigray leaders and people should back Tigray military, Tigray leadership and uh, people should know that uh, military is fighting for them, so they should support them. We saw similar messages from Varede. I think there is no difference between what Varede said and what Debrasian said. Both uh, are saying that they are making adjustments. They are retreating from some places, uh, these are tactical moves, they will continue their fight. Question only is, where will they fight? That remains to be seen. In, in coming videos, we will try to update you about that.